Hello and welcome. This is Chris Wren. I'm going to be showing you a mobile version of my lunar prototype today. Uh, as you can see, I'm running it on a Galaxy Samsung Note 4. And uh, the frame rate is really smooth. It's using the accelerometer currently to look around. So that if I were to move up, down, left, right, you would see as the phone moves around, so too does my view in the game. And for mobile, one of the challenges you have is trying to create a control scheme that works well with a single button press. A lot of these headsets do come with Bluetooth controllers, which make it a lot easier, more like keyboard, mouse, or a console. Uh, but if you don't have that, for the masses, for those that just bought the $15 headset and don't have a Bluetooth controller, uh, a way to get around on the moon. So I created a single button press because almost every one of these headsets comes with at least a single button that you can interact with. And so what I did was, if, if you push that single button, the character starts to move, okay? And whatever direction the accelerometer moves, you can still move freely within the UI and reach out and touch things within the UI. But if you want to move in a particular direction, you just kind of turn yourself towards that direction, and the game will gradually move in that way. So it's a single button press, three-axis controller. And it works pretty well. There you go. All right, so you'll notice that I've hooked this thing up uh, to a Leap Motion controller, and I've hooked it up uh, to the phone, so the phone is actually powering the Leap Motion controller. And what we're going to take a look at is how you can then use your hands to gesture and touch things in the 3D world. So I'm going to do my best to get the camera lined up here so you can kind of see what I see in the game world. There we go. And as I reach out with my hand, hand in the 3D world shows up and I can actually touch things with this button for example and affect things in my 3D world. So without too much trouble there's the lunar demo in 3D on a phone with the latest Leap Motion SDK.